The DeSoto Square Mall in Bradenton is changing owners. The mall is up for sale this past summer, and now the new owners will be the mall's fourth since opening in 1973. ABC 7's Dwayne Lindo is joining us now live from Bradenton with more on what changes could be on the way. Dwayne. Well, Haley, management has been hoping to turn things around at this mall since the opening of the University Town Center. They seem to be on the right track for a while, but after numerous closings, some tenants are wondering, can the mall survive another owner? Stephanie Ortiz is visiting DeSoto Square Mall for the first time in years. Well, I used to come here, but it's really dead, so I don't really like coming here anymore. When Ortiz and her friends heard the mall had reportedly been sold to new owners, they had some advice get better stores like there's not really good stores for us young people it needs like stores for like younger people you know because this mall's pretty dead the 43 year old mall has seen its shares of ups and downs in the past couple years with the loss of macy's one of its anchor stores as well as chick-fil-a aeropostale and a number of other stores but when the mall acquiring a few new stores as of late first-time business owner nancy guzman felt the mall had potential People just got to take a chance and open some stores. Her store, White Craft, Black Market, specializing in candles and incense, has seen some business, but she says it could be better. Could use a little bit more food traffic. Get more business in here. That'll bring more people. The price and the buyer of the mall has not yet been disclosed, but according to the mall's current general manager, Don Burroughs, the mall was at 60% capacity when he took over. Now it's at 73% capacity. He hopes that percentage will keep going up. But Ortiz says until that happens, she'll do the alternative. Tampa, Sarasota, Clearwater, wherever I can get, you know, good quality clothes and stuff and better stores. Now, mall management says they will be announcing a press conference not long from now regarding new ownership and the future of DeSoto Square Mall. Reporting in Bradenton, Dwayne Lindo, your Suncoast News. All right, Dwayne, thank you.